This podcast is brought to you by the new Nikon Coolpix P1 and P2 digital cameras, the world's first compact cameras with built-in Wi-Fi. Now you can take great pictures and easily transfer them directly to your computer or printer wirelessly. Learn more at NikonDigital.com. Andrew Edwards from here live here with Jeff Lyons of Cool It Systems. What we're looking at is a water-cooled Xbox 360. Jeff, tell us about this. Well, what we've got here is, from, uh, I thought, a great opportunity for Cool It Systems to showcase our technology. We've spent about four and a half years in R&D developing what we call M-Tech technology. We use multiple thermoelectric coolers to actually refrigerate the liquid that we use to then sap the heat away from hot processors. This application here, that Xbox, we heard all of the comments and rumors about the fact that the boxes were failing and people were having troubles and complaints were coming in for too much heat. We thought, of we thought well, I bet we can probably cool that. We went and bought one. We took it apart. We replaced the stock heat sinks and we put in fluid heat exchangers right on the processors. Now what we see here, we put one on the GPU, one on the CPU, and then we circulate that liquid across a chiller. It's actually chilling that liquid using multiple thermoelectric coolers. Okay. Now, is this something that, like, just a nice project that you guys wanted to do just to do it, or is this something that people are going to be able to pick up and do themselves? Well, it's something that's a little bit complex when we're getting into how how to get into this box alone yeah. is a bear. No screws. No. How did you get in there? It's, it's, how long did it take you to get in there? It's an, I'll, I'll put it this way, it's an almost tamper-proof case. Okay. Um, so the idea being that we're probably going to go through an authorized mod program. We'll go to all the local mod shops, teach them how to install this product so that they can offer it to their customers. Okay. Now there's a... This fan hooks into the case. What we've got there is actually just the, the fan portion of the chiller that you can see here, and it's actually ejecting the heat after it goes through this chilling module up here. Okay, so it's sticking out of the case, but it's also inside. That's right. Okay. We and had to expand it, you know, obviously. like you would a hood of a car. You put modifications. On. Okay. And for those wondering, um, I'm actually standing here and I can't hear anything. Um, it's a large fan. When you buy the Xbox 360, you can't really see the fans. The fans are pretty small, but when you turn it on, it's loud. It sounds like a, a jet's about to take off in your living room. How does this sound compared, compared to the normal Xbox? It's pretty much silent. In fact, the only sound you can hear when you've got the Xbox running with a game in it is actually the the optical drive. Okay. You can, you can hear that spinning around, but other than that, the fan is almost silent. Wonderful. And when do you think this might be available? We're looking to launch this summer. Okay. Very cool. Thanks a lot, Jeff. I appreciate you coming by the booth. This podcast is brought to you by the new Nikon Coolpix P1 and P2 digital cameras, the world's first compact cameras with built-in Wi-Fi. Now you can take great pictures and easily transfer them directly to your computer or printer wirelessly. Learn more at NikonDigital.com.